Hello, I'm Seth Johnson with Land the House. So I was watching a video by Engineer775. He had a hydraulic ram pump with lots of feet of head that he nozzled down to a pressure washer nozzle in hopes of using a Pelton wheel um, with that pressure generated. thought that was a pretty cool idea, so I have actually gotten a couple of nozzles and I'm going to try it with the one and a quarter ram pump off of about three and a half feet of head just to see what happens. Got um, a one fourth nozzle and then a three sixteenths. So let's try those two out and see what happens. Let's start by trying out this one fourth nozzle. Now somebody at Lowe's decided to uh, strip the threads for me, but we'll see if I can get it to work here. All right, hopefully my pump is primed and ready to go. So I'm gonna turn it on here. So I'm not sure what pressure will keep um, the tank full. You know, this right here can't pass too many gallons per minute. So, let's see what happens. That's pretty awesome right there. See how long it'll run. It's been going now for about a minute. And you can see it has not let up the pressure. So, now let's try cutting down to the 3 16th nozzle and see what happens. Okay, so now I've got this brass nozzle that's 3 16th. So now let's see what happens. We turn this one on. The jet of water here seems to have a lot less fall over the distance there. Still a little bit. So I don't know a whole lot about generating power, but that doesn't seem like it's too terribly strong. It may have actually been better with the, uh, the one fourth. But, uh, I don't really have a way of testing out how much pressure there would be without the pump working. But I'm going to guess there's more pressure off this three feet with the pump going. Well, this is a very interesting concept. I think if you had two, three, four more feet of head instead of just this three and a half, you could really generate a lot of pressure out of one of these nozzles possibly enough to run a Pelton wheel off of just three or four, five, six feet of head. Um, so I've got a test Pelton wheel that I worked with in the past. I may bring that back out and um, try and get some electricity out of this thing. Anyway, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you next time. Very interesting stuff. I always appreciate people like Engineer775 who come up with new ideas like this. Well, if you enjoy this hydraulic ram pump video, you might like my demo model video. Click here to your left to watch that. And do remember, I sell the hydraulic ram pumps pre-assembled on my website, landahouse.com, so you can also click here to your right to uh, go there and buy your own pump. If you like this video, hit that thumbs up button. It helps my channel to grow. And be sure to subscribe because I have all kinds of new content on the way. I'm Seth Johnson with Landa House, and I will see you next time.